Welcome back to the crew too. It's been a while, but things have changed here. Things are new, things are different, and we're gonna dive straight in. I am so excited for this update. There's a whole bunch of new content. First things first, we choose a new avatar. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Look, hobbies. This is what I'm most interested in. Hobbies, themed activities. Uh, this, I have honestly, I can't tell what it is. It's very difficult to tell, but there seems to be some very significant cars coming along with that. There's also new vanity items, the Jesco, and the obviously new avatars that I was talking about. There's a whole bunch of new content coming in this. But first things first, as I said, we're going to choose our first br our brand new avatars, which are reworked from the ground up, and they look fantastic. Hopefully, we have a uh, nice light-skinned man, Maji. I mean, I guess that's pretty close. I... <laughs> Uh, we're gonna go for number eight. All right, that'll do. He's dabbing a little bit. I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna accept that. So the menu has had a little bit of a rework. And look at that! Awesome, brand new music and everything going on here. That is beautiful. Why did they even need to do this? Why did they do this? <laughs> go to pilot to hobbies. Really want to know what that is. You got the crew management over here, and of course the activities as per normal, and the settings has changed to a little cog now. This is really, really cool. And the icon points as well. One thing, if you didn't know, you can spend five at a time now as well, which is is ideal. Holy crap! It's third person! We're walking around in third person! That's awesome! That's really, really cool. I, I definitely need to customize my character a little bit. We're going to do that a little bit later. But right now, we need to get over to this Jesco and jump in and buy it. Because this is the brand, the latest car in the game. This car, I couldn't even describe to you what makes this so fantastic. Other than that, it is fantastic. We need to back away. We need, we need to have a look at what else there is over here. Because there's brand new vanity items as well, which we. I kind of want to put them on the car. I'll be back. We just bought the car, which is nice. It doesn't force us outside the dealership now, which is really, really good. Because that means we can go straight over here and spend some extra money on it. Because why the heck not? Let's jump in. So we've got the welcome pack. That might be a new car. 370Z Nismo. I don't have it. Either way, I don't, I don't have it. Uh, we've also got the uh, red tires. That's, that's really cool. It matches that car really, really well. I've got the underglow as well. Cool. So we have emotes. We have a black window tint, which I'm definitely buying. How can you not buy the black window tint? We've got the... What is this? It's a brand new horn. I purchased that one. American baby! <laughs> and all these crazy off-road tires. This has got there's so many new vanity items in here that I'm going to be buying all of these. Of course, you can you pay for crew credits to get these items. You can get these through the summit, I imagine, later on. And you can also earn them by doing the little daily challenge bits. So I'm actually going to buy these as well because those looked fantastic. The brand new summits are available. This summit that's currently going on gives you the party like nitro which interestingly i may actually give it a go now that we're back on the crew we've got the tvr griffith peppermint edition and some british union jack tires we've got a blue neon window tint very nice we've got the race tour rag or the tow rag and we've got a few other cars in my we've got the emote i'm interested about these emotes look at the exhaust shaking it's beautiful and we just got some red tires Holy crap. This is going to be amazing. I cannot wait. Let's go for a drive then, shall we? Let's get it going, baby. I'm ready. The Koenigsegg Jessica. I don't know much about this car other than it's ridiculous. And it turns with the wheel. The Speedo turns with the wheel. That's just absolutely unnecessary. I don't understand why you would ever need to do that. But they've done it anyway, because why the hell not? They've also updated some of the handling on this game as well. And I imagine this has got the new handling model. You can tell it's very, very grippy. Very grippy indeed. And we've got classic NOS that you can use whenever you want. Oh! It's really, really play and shoot. It's really sharp. It's it turns too much. I love looking through these cars. We just level up the extreme each time. This car is just the borderline limits of sanity. And now we're flying to the other end. This is 294 as a standard, this car. So we're going to jump in here. It's so cool. We're walking around our apartment now. That is really, really nice. Right. Customization of the whip. Are you ready? This 
has got to be good. This has got to be good. It's a comeback for this game. And it, this needs to solidify my return to the game. Let's see what hoods have we got with a carbon hood. Of course, we've got some crazy vents on the front. Some crazy vents and some carbon. Why the heck not? Let's go for this one right here. Just a little bit, little bit of carbon on the front. A little bit extra. We've got 12 front bumper options, which of course includes the lights and the such as well. We've got a nice pinstripe. We've got an all white front. Very cool. And what else? We got more aggressive carbon. So from the very end of it to the very start of it, honestly, there's just a kind of adjustment to the lip, which actually gives it a much more aggressive look. We've got front fender option. Is that going to give us a wide body? No, <laughs> it's going to add more canards. I'll take more canards. We've got wheels as well, which goes to the... We've got the, the standard ones, which I generally... I'm going to stay. If, there's, if the standard is available, I'm sticking with the standard. The, the brake calipers, I'm actually going to go with the lime green to match the front accents a little bit. we got the side mirror customization. Very cool. Very nice. Side skirts. Do we have any big aggressive ones? No, we can actually change them only to paint. We've got rear wing customization, which... Oh my goodness. We're taking the wing to a whole new level, baby. And going through, we've got some painted little diffuser ends which i very much very much like and even better a more aggressive rear end which i'm genuinely thinking that this looks better of course we need the vanity to match so we're gonna go for do we go with the green oh that is perfect that is perfect for this car we've got the smokes we're not gonna touch we've got the undergo we're not gonna touch we're gonna put the window tint on it's already applied if we remove it oh that's a good tint and we got the horns as well i forgot about that do we did we apply this <laughs> of course you know what time it is it's time to put 320 every tang all over this jesco iridescent colors i just want to i want to have a scroll through i'm probably going to keep it in the white just because it suits it probably the best but i wanted to see what other colors would suit this car and i'm gonna say that the best color is very clearly the white or one of the standard colors. Let's go through these. We'll go for the blue. Yeah, honestly, the white is where I would go or a gray. It's a bit of a strange car. I figured it out. I figured out how to do the emotes. So I'm actually going to show you now. You press down on the D-pad and it gives you a collection of emotes that you can now perform. And unfortunately, they look like sack boy. I've come to realize. But if you do those emotes, it just very much puts that there. I thought the, the character would act. I've also figured out that you can now run. You can hold R2 or press the left stick in and they shall perform a run and you can run around your apartment like a madman like you're trying to rob it. I have just realized something. The back end of this car has just got better. Look at the titanium tip. <laughs> I would have just realized, look at this wing. Oh my God, it just takes off. Two, nine, 251, is at the top speed? I, I, nah, that's baby numbers. That's not... That's baby numbers. We're expecting more than that, right? We're going to get some 251. Nah, we're past it. <laughs> in the cockpit view as well. Oh, mate. I only make minute adjustments and this thing is planted to the ground. I am super happy that it's finally in the game. And in the crew too. There's also a bunch of other cars that have been added in this update, which I'm definitely going to be making videos on. Do not worry about that. We're back, baby. I'm glad I'll be back. Oh! Hold that speed a little bit. That wing is doing its thing. I did not expect this game to be the first to get this car. And now in the comments, I can hear you saying, oh, well, this mobile game got it. I'm talking about the real game. That, that's right. We are re we real gamers over here. <laughs> Kidding, but no, I'm, I'm really, really happy they've added this. I'm really happy that the crew is back with a bunch of new summits, a bunch of new updates, a bunch of new things for us to unlock and play with. I, I'm definitely going to get back to grinding on this game. I've missed grinding on a game. I've, I've not had to do it for a good while. And the crew too is definitely one of those that I want to get all the vanity items, all the parts, everything, ev everything that comes out that's new. I love that wing. It's so freaking cool. It's so stable. I can't tell if it's just this car or if it's the new reworked handling. They were saying that hypercars have been modified. One of the priorities this update, which they generally do tweak cars and the handling a little bit per update. It's, it seems to be, well, I, I wonder the hobbies. The hobbies is the most exciting part that I, we, we, we still have access to. I'm interested to see when they're going to roll that out. Is it going to be week one, week two, week three? Is it going to be a month? Is it going to be a year? Nah. But doing some like off-roading on hypercars is now almost, well, it's more difficult, essentially. You're not going to be off-roading, doing off-road challenges in your hypercars as well as before, which is what I like to see. Um, that's a tree. What do you think of the Jesco? Are you a fan? 
Are you not? Do you like the green tires that I put on? Does it need a green underglow? Can you even get a green underglow yet? If not, I'm sure we can now in the new update. And I'm very excited to finally be able to actually do that. That would be nice. I want green underglow. Green underglow. Please. Please. We're going to try and find it. Surely it's going to be put in the shop soon. Because then I have the beautiful green machine. And it'll look fantastic throughout. It already does. But we can make it look even more personalized and better. As we come up to the finish. A ridiculous speed. Come on. Oh, that was almost a 280. I'm going to keep going. Stuff your, stuff your rewards. 448 kilometers. I saw 448 kilometers. Missed me, missed me items. What on earth was he doing? 448. 448. Oh! <laughs> Holy crap, we're almost going 300 miles an hour. Holy crap. You know we need to do this. We need to go and find the long straight. The best place to do it is probably the salt flats. Let's be real. Let's go. We're ready. We're ready. We're ready. I'm going to make sure I'm going in the best direction. I think this is probably the better way to go. Give it a boost every now and again. Get that speed built up. This chest goes ready for some speed, baby. Come on. We're 270s. We're getting the 280s. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I don't want to run out of road. I don't want to run out of road. I'm going to run out of road. God damn it. We almost got 300. We, we got the salt flats are too bumpy. Well, this has not gone well. What are we doing? What are we doing? 270. Boost, baby. Come on. 290. I know we can do better than that, Jesco. Hold it stable at 280. And build up a little bit more boost. No, there's a big turn coming. No. 280, baby. I want to get this speed trap a good one. <laughs> We're going for it, baby. 288. This is not going well. This is really not going well. This time we've got it. This time we've got it. We're going to get to 800 without even boosting. Come on, baby. Downhill matters. Downhill help. Ground speed highlight. That's right. Record beaten. I'm going to keep pushing. I'm going to make it even better. Come on. Oh, 299. This is the best way I've found to do it. Come on, change. It didn't change quick enough. Look. Oh my god, we went through it. It's okay, it's okay. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Bit of a boost down the hill. Come on! Come on! Yes! 300! <laughs> yes! Yes, we did it, baby! 300 miles an hour in the Crew 2 in a hypercar. The latest hypercar in the Crew 2. All you need to do is jump on the game, update it, jump in, and you can buy this car for yourself. Be sure to smash like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.